Okay, this piece, Quarry Ghost, um, was inspired by um, a book that I read uh, about Nelson Mandela where it mentions that um, he was covered with qu quarry dust at the end of the day and they looked like ghosts. So I wanted to portray the ghostly nature of that statement but also to me it represents all of the ghosts that are actually left there from the quarry. All the prisoners who were there and are no longer there and their ghosts I feel probably still um, roam for lack of a better word uh, in the quarry at Robben Island. Uh, it's a inspirational idea and I wanted to use something that's different than maybe showing the prison cell or the bars or things like that. Um, there's something about that labor, the hardness of it that he experienced and that he could come back to us uh, as a society and be as forgiving as he was. Um, it's truly inspirational. So that's what Quarry Ghost is about. Uh, the challenge as a quilter is to show ghost in a quarry setting where the colors are so similar and to decide on the figures. So this is one of these quilts that I, I made it and had different figures on it. And I guess um, I didn't like it. There's some part of me that didn't like that. So it was again on my living room floor looking at me for a while. And then I thought about it and I thought, oh, I think I need, I need them to look a little differently. So I, so I took all those figures off and put a different set on. Uh, they were still doing things. I just, it just didn't quite fit it as well as these do. Uh, so that's what it's all about. And I'm looking forward to going in and actually seeing the quarry and visiting Robin Island in July when I uh, attend uh, the uh, San, uh, South African International Quilt Festival. I'm looking forward to that because this will be my first trip to Africa. So. It's going to be a challenge and a reward. I expect I'll have a whole new set of ideas and lots of pictures, more things to make.